All right, so first off, uh, the two people here in the debate are Jewish, so I'm going to say I'm pretty sure there's nothing in the Talmud that says human flesh isn't kosher, so, like, right away, you're good there, like, you've got, like, you're allowed to try it, it's core. Uh, secondly, I'll level with you, so I have this thing called Crohn's disease, it's an inflammatory bowel disease, don't Google image search that, but uh, it basically, like, it's like, you know, you have a lot of digestive problems. So I figure if I can eat someone's healthier colon or healthier intestines, it'll it might heal and cure my intestinal problems. And it's a lot less awkward than getting like a fecal transplant, which is the new sort of like thing to do for uh, people with bowel disease. So I figure it's good. And then at the end of the day, like it's just impolite. If someone invites you to their home, you know... <laughs> You try the local food. You go to New Orleans. You try crawfish. You go to the Hannibal Lecter's house. You try human flesh. It's only common manners. Not so hard. For All right. Thank you. Thank you, Dan. I would note that crawfish is not kosher, so perhaps you, you don't value this as much as you, uh, as you claim. Uh, all right. Uh, arguing against consuming human flesh... <laughs> is Ryan's Zeitz. Ryan. I can tell you all want to eat a piece of this, eh? But no, don't do it because I'm arguing against it. <laughs> First and foremost, Hannibal Lecter has the worst fucking taste in wine. A Chianti does not pair with human flesh. Crack out a bottle of Chateau Neuf de Pop and maybe we'll talk. <laughs> Secondly, you know, I, like, I'm not against eating people for, like, any moral reason. I don't want to eat people because, like, what if it was really good? <laughs> like, what if it was so fucking good? Like, what if it was, like, Wagyu beef and it was just so delicious and you needed more of it? And if it was like Wagyu beef, like, I, I don't think any of us need to see TikToks of Gordon Ramsay criticizing people cooking human flesh. <laughs> we don't need that in the world. <laughs> And last, <laughs> I tried, I tried. <laughs> last but not least, what's the proper etiquette, right? Like, I get it, to, to, you know, for eating a human from head to toe, for most of it, dinner fork, steak knife, but like when you get to the anus, do you switch to a salad fork? Uh, <laughs> thank you, Ryan. Okay, Dan, you have 30 seconds to respond, starting now. So, Ryan brought up a good point. When you get to the anus, salad fork. Right, because we all eat ass. It's 2022. Everyone's eating ass now. So who cares? Like, it's not that big of a jump to then start eating, like, the actual ass, like, <laughs> and get outside the hole. Like, you might as well start eating it. And also, finally, like, it's fucking Hannibal Lecter. Like, are you going to say no? I'd rather, if you don't eat the human flesh he presents you, you're going to be dinner the next day. So I say you <laughs> might as well eat it. Eat whatever ass he puts in front of you, uh, and then your ass will be safe. That's my argument. All right. Thank you, Dan. Ryan, you have the last word. 30 seconds, starting now. Dan, I can tell you want to eat my ass, but, like... <laughs> <laughs> there's, a, there's a lot of focus on eating ass. Also, I want to say that Crohn's disease is a really shitty reason to eat people, okay? <laughs> That's right, a poop joke, right yeah. after an ass-eating joke. That's all I've got. Thanks, everybody. All right, thank you. Give it up. For E. coli, apparently. <laughs> All right, now you, the audience, get to decide. Do you agree with Dan Rosen that we should try some human flesh? Hey, Hannibal's cooking. He went to the effort. Or do you agree with Ryan Zeitz that no, maybe we shouldn't all get uh, a prion disease? All right, human flesh it is. Delicious. I want to say that if we do start to raise humans like Wagyu beef cows, I volunteer to be fed beer and massaged every day. Yeah. <laughs> Until I am fat and delicious and dead on a businessman's plate.